You're not ready to go home. You need to concentrate on getting yourself well. But you just admitted I'm getting better all the time. Carla, that doesn't mean you're fully recovered. But you're my husband. You can get me out of here. We both know what you want out of here. Sonny. Going back to Sonny right now won't solve anything. You know what? Sonny took care of me when I was sick, and he stood by me, and he protected me. Sonny refused to get you professional help. He let you deteriorate to the point that you became endangered to yourself. He's the reason you're in this I don't want to do this. I don't want to, you know, uh, figure out what happened and figure out who was right and who was wrong. Sonny did the best he could, and now I am starting to feel stronger, and I'm starting to feel like my old self again. With Sonny at the center of your universe. You don't understand me and Sonny, and you know what? You never have. Right, determined, you love your children, you have so much to offer the world, and you're just wasting your time on Sonny. Okay, let me get this straight. So you're going to keep me locked up here until I say the words, I don't love Sonny anymore? No, you just need time to rest. I'm rested. Give yourself a chance to become the strong, independent woman I fell in love with, and we'll talk about getting you out of here. So you're, you're not going to do it? You're not going to get me out of here tonight so I can go see my boys? I'm sorry. You're not ready. Then you're wasting my time. I want a divorce. Now. I have done nothing but try to help you. Then prove it. Show me that this isn't one more maneuver to try and keep me away from Sonny. Get me out of here. I want you to get well. I am well. You're fixated on someone who only wants to control you. Oh, what the hell are you doing? Telling me who I can and can't love? Deciding when I can get out of this place? The doctors said you're not ready. Oh, because I'm so obsessed with Sonny. Right. You're just mad because I'm not obsessed with you. You know, it's ironic, I suppose. You've lost yourself in Sonny the way I lost myself in you. You are just jealous. You know that? You're jealous. You're jealous because I'm not choosing you. And because I'm not, you're going to keep me locked up in this place. Man, we've come full circle, haven't we? Remember when we first met? I was chained to a wall, and you could have freed me, but you didn't. So much has happened since then. Yeah. I don't know, I think we're right back where we started. Well, for one thing, you've had a nervous break. <laughs> I'm better. Okay, look at me, I'm better. And you're just upset because I still love Sonny, and he loves me. You need to believe that, I understand. Just the way I needed to believe that you love me when it's so obvious that you don't. I don't want you making any decisions for me anymore. I don't want any ties. Well, you will have your divorce as soon as possible. Works for me. Right. Just think about what you're doing, Carly. Your obsession has led you nowhere, as did mine. Nowhere but Rose Lawn Sanitarium. <laughs>